taking the scanner, and again, I don't know anything about it, but it's it's $150,000 scanners. Did I seriously, did I seriously break it? Man, I don't know. I might have. So, red light. I held it for 30 seconds. Today is gonna to be a rad day. We got some people coming over and all I know is just a few facts. We're scanning the Lincoln. So you guys have seen us break down in the car, put wheels on it that we absolutely hate and just have some fun with it. But today is gonna to be cool because they're taking the scanner. And again, I don't know anything about it, but it's, it's $150,000 scanner. So they're gonna take the scanner and as they walk by the car, it's gonna go into the computer. So at the end of the day, we're gonna see a full 3D model of the entire Lincoln. That way, my dad's wanting to keep the car simple, but I'm thinking build a crazy wide body off, so that's what the whole point of this episode is. Yeah, that's gonna be a lot of fun. And uh, and so once it's in the computer, we could uh, you know start stretching fenders and doing different things, so. It's a bad sign, it's a bad sign, because we are, We're, we wanna keep it simple, but he's scanning the car, this is how it starts, just like the C10. And then he's got all the geometry, so if we build anything off it and machine it, then it goes back on. I, I don't even think anyone knows what you just said. Let's, uh, let's meet these guys and let's have a good time. Damn! Dude, that is a big truck right there. Oh, okay. I like this. This is sick. I didn't know you guys were rolling in deep like this. Yeah, man. What's up? I'm Brad. I'm Jason. Good Jason, to meet you. Nice to meet you. What's up? What's up, right, buddy? Brad, very nice to meet you. What's up, man? How you doing? Good, you? Good. Nice to see you. Yeah. It's been a while. Yeah. So you guys got that bad boy scanner, huh? Oh, yeah. That thing's a, a bunch of them. It's a $150,000 scanner? Max says out at $150,000 with the software, computer. Full package, yeah. So, Starting around a hundred thousand. So I should probably not hold it. That's what you're saying. Uh, yeah, you I, I don't to, know. You man. got insurance. I bring a lot of stuff. We, <laughs> we brought the ten thousand dollar one too, and the forty thousand dollar or the sixty thousand dollar one. Oh, since yeah, you guys brought a few, just actually oh, leave yeah. one. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> let it fall off the truck. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, let me show you the Lincoln. Kind of show cool. you guys what we got here. Well, yeah, really text me. Do not let Brad touch this stuff. So the, these wheels, these just came with it. It looks horrible. Okay. But the whole plan is really we don't have a plan. Yeah. So uh, we don't know exactly what we're doing. My, my dad wants to keep it simple. You know, do a few <laughs> things. I'm thinking the the whole reason is like with you guys is to scan it, put it in the computer, and kind of like what we did on the C10, yeah. is, is maybe start designing a wide body and do some stuff. But I just thought it might be an interesting episode for, for everyone to kind of watch. Yeah. You know, not everyone gets to watch a car, you know, in real life, and then all of a sudden yeah. see it in the computer. And there's a, um, a large volume scanner designed for scanning uh, full aircraft, full vehicles, and doing it at very high resolution, high accuracy. Jason, I could tell you're smart, dude. You're a smart guy. <laughs> I can just tell you, like, I can feel the information. He just talks to you. <laughs> totally. Yeah. Well, yeah, you, it's you the guys, glasses. This is yeah. the monster. This is the monster. I like that truck, too. Appreciate it, man. You got asked uh, by a customer yesterday if Brad DeBerti built that truck. No, he did it. I swear to you. Really? Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Now, this will be cool. We'll let these guys get out here, everything unloaded. This is very interesting. You can tell these guys are super smart. They, I think they actually invented the scanner. But it'll be just really cool to see the car here and then in the computer. So let's get her going. Are you guys going to war? I mean, you guys have, this is like... <laughs> <laughs> well, we kind of wanted a lot of containers. You know? There's grenades in there. <laughs> Basically, uh, most of the scanners in our um, fleet with us. So the Metro scans the big boy. The Peel's an entry level scanner for oh, perfect. I'll hobbyists. Take, I'll, I'll leave that one over here. <laughs> keep that one in the back. Yeah. <laughs> that's uh, it's an affordable <laughs> professional grade scanner that's affordable. Uh -huh. Five hundred dollars for it. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. For sure, you're gonna leave that. That's great. So it would be you <laughs> could use it texture. for um, things face. like a wide body kit and. Um, body panels where you don't need like super high accuracy 
but not the best scanner for machine parts. It yeah, it's like you're gonna iron some clothes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's nice. So 500 bucks. 8500 Oh, 8500 <laughs> Also, 500 bucks. I'm buying it right now. <laughs> Sold. How much you got on you? Yeah. <laughs> Black Elite over there is a, it's an ISO certified scanner that uh, runs about 70000 That's not bad. And that's what you would use for engine components, you know, if you want to scan heads or something like that. Gotcha. All right. Mm -hmm. So you guys are using the big one today. We're using the big boy. All right. Mm -hmm. Check it out. Yep. I don't know if I've ever seen. Uh, we've we've used a lot of like the ferrule arms back in the day, and yeah, I'm used to the 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 tripod looking thing, and you, you kind of do that and then keep having to move it. But okay. that's that's the one I've seen before. So that has the cameras. That's the C track. And this is the Metro. This it displays the uh, lasers. That's what the lasers come out of. It's got 15 lasers. This is the this is part of the hundred fifty thousand dollar mm -hmm. Yeah. Can this I is... hold it? Yep. <laughs> yeah. So oh, sure. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> got him. <laughs> <laughs> so this is all. What are these things right here? So those are the targets, and the C track picks up those targets. And you'll notice on these other scanners. They actually have, this is the camera right here on the C-Track. On the other handheld scanners, the camera is actually on the unit. And that's why with those other ones, you have to use targets. So you stick targets on the car. I've seen that on like NASCAR. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that is uh, definitely pretty cool. Yeah. Well, you guys get cool set toys. up. I'm, cool. I'm excited to see this bad boy work. Yeah. See what's important about scanning a vehicle is this, this car especially built, this car is not equal on this side than this side. So like when we designed the C10, same thing, we had to build the wide body to it and both fenders are actually completely different, but no one would ever know because this part could be a little longer, it could be a little wider here. It, it could have, you know, over time had some rust so someone patched it or whatever. So it's, it's important to scan the whole car. That way when we when we start coming out and we build the fenders to sit, everything sits perfect. I mean, that that's a whole goal of having this kind of technology. This though, I've never, I've never seen. So this is gonna be, Pretty interesting. He said, "All I remember is one hundred fifty thousand dollars." It it starts around a hundred thousand, right. and then with a for a full package with um, software training computer, um, maxes out around one hundred and fifty thousand. So all I remember is one hundred fifty thousand and one point million dots or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> one point eight. Like one point eight million. <laughs> As he's moving. <laughs> yeah, the, oh. the focus is real. <laughs> you have to go like this. <laughs> it doesn't even make sense that, that you could actually just scan something. Dude, all I know how to do is reset the router. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah <laughs> reset the internet. These guys are over here. Uh, I don't even know what this would even be considered. <laughs> Creating our Wi-Fi right now? Yeah. Well, now I, think, he's I think this is how you do it. This is kind of like when they, when they turn it. <laughs> yeah. It's a very expensive baton. How much is that baton right there? It's, uh, I think it's about $1,500. It's carbon fiber. The calibration. This is just the calibration <laughs> process. I mean, we haven't even seen the car. <laughs> This is like, I would be cool with just this like if they're all, hey, we gotta go, like I'd be happy at this point. <laughs> We're gonna tell my dad to hold this for like five minutes. He's gonna hold still. Here, no, you tell him, because then, then he'll know you're serious. No, Jason, you tell him. He knows me. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? That's funny, I've seen that truck driving here. Oh, yeah, yeah, we saw you going the other oh, way. Oh, you did? How's it going, dad, What's happening? What, what is going on? I just talked to Rim. Yeah, I had no idea. Hey, they wanted to involve us and in kind of like this whole pro. Have you seen all this? No, not this at all. Look at this. 1.8 million dots? 1.8 million points per second. Points per second. Do you mind holding that, sir? Come over here, Dan. What do you yeah, want? Yeah, that's a calibration bar. So we're, we're we're in the process of calibrating the system right there. Right Where do now. you want him to stand with that? Oh, right oh. there in front. Me too. Isn't that man. cool? <laughs> yeah, Dan, that's 1,500 bucks. Be careful. Is that 1,500 bones? <laughs> we're, we're, this, no. is Don't drop it. this is a $150,000 oh, setup. Right. Picture an imaginary box that we're scanning in. And it just needs to see that bar it's calibrated. Yeah, so this this is pretty cool. Yeah. So you don't have you to hold it steady. You yeah. Do, yeah, and wait till this light turns green. Up or down or yeah. Kind of, you'll you'll figure you'll find the sweet spot. Kind of put a little finesse into it and use your mind, you know, think 
calibrate. Be the machine, Dad. Be the machine. Well, I'm trying to see what. So those eyes you're looking at. Uh huh. Those yeah. are cameras. Okay, so those are kind of pointed like down. Like what we're seeing or no? They're kind of pointed down on exposure. You can move around a little more. Well, I don't know how fa how fast do you move the thing. Oh wait, it's backwards here. Spin it around. There you go. <laughs> yeah, I had a trouble on my first time too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is it supposed to scan this? Oh yeah, yeah, you're right. Turn it around again. Don't hit the bar. Oh, you're in on the crap. Don't hit us. Don't hit us. This is all beginning. I'm thinking, okay, I've seen the thing, Sam. All right, now let's get the scan. You're all yeah, whatever. I'm not listening to you either. You were so serious. What the hell's he having me? You should have seen me calibrating this thing earlier. I was the fool. Oh, that's great. We could do that. <laughs> How long do you think it'll take you to scan this whole car? 30 minutes. You're okay. kidding. Yeah, probably, probably about an hour or so. Because it's going to have to take longer in. than scanning. So Five back minutes, back in the day, my dad, 72 years ago, um, when they had some. Okay, some, okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, usually it, it takes a whole day to scan a vehicle. So that's wow. why it's, able to get he says about 30 uh, minutes to an hour. That's pretty impressive. I've never seen that. I've never yeah. seen something scan a whole car in that quick of a time. Holy yeah, cow, it's outside. storming outside. <laughs> I like how it was like perfectly yeah. sunny at that second ago. All right, I'm going to start. You're going to start? Yeah. All right, cool. So here we go. Here All we right. go. Here we go. As he's going, look at how fast that's tracking. It's unbelievable. That is incredible. Holy cow. So the yellow is telling us we need more data on this area. Just guiding him to Unbelievable. Scan it That's over insane. That a bit I mean, he hasn't even been. I bet he's been scanning for two minutes and he's already got the whole front of the car. <laughs> You know what the worst part about this whole deal is? This is how every single build we do starts. And we didn't want to do this. I didn't do this just in case, did. That's what you always say. And then we get everything in the background. Pretty soon I'll be, I just want to put a, let's just draw a wide body and just see how it looks off this data. Yeah, no, it happens every time. And we swore we wouldn't do this again, this crazy. He go, and then all of a sudden he goes, hey, these guys are just gonna come try this new $150,000 piece of equipment out. <laughs> and I've never seen it drawn this quick, ever. No, so good. this takes hours, yeah, usually with, with, with an average something. scanner. This scanner. is this is insane. I mean, I this does get me kind yeah, of man, fired these types up of tools too. change your life. My dad didn't want to do the scan because again, he's- Because it leads into <laughs> a full build. Yeah. Let me give you guys a little perspective here. See, that's what happens. But the only way that you could make this is do this, is come in and scan your vehicle. So for anybody out there watching this for the first time, once you do this and get all the geometry captured, you could go in and, and as crazy as, as it sounds, easily do this. It's just time and cost a little bit of money. By the way, I don't know what artist actually drew this. I just kind of found it on Google. I think they did a good job. I think there's a lot of things that I would change for the real car, but if we go that route, there'd be a lot of changes I would do. Again, that's the whole kind of point of this because what we could do now, once we have this car on the computer is we could actually make the changes. Look, at, as he goes through, you could see that when there's parts of Bondo on the car, like over here, that might be a rust, mm -hmm. rust dot right there. Yep. That's just, you see the imperfections of the car. Well, when if you, you go see that right there. Is so that, look at that car. It's just look a little car. paint chip right there. That's that, a paint chip on the car. So th this is getting it as close to exact as you could ever get. <laughs> oh yeah, see, I was trying not to move. That's like sick. That. <laughs> All right, well, what we'll do is when the when the car is done, I'll just make a little bobblehead of me yeah. <laughs> on the dash. On the dash. That's, yeah. that's pretty cool. Oh no, you already bought one. <laughs> sure, we can wrap Eight it right thousand now. dollars. Yep. This is all we need. Yeah. Everything we wanted to Super scan. Super attainable. I like how my dad's all upset that we're scanning today and now he wants to buy a scanner. I know, <laughs> yeah. but this is what makes me mad. It's just more work. <laughs> well, what it does is it, it gets you excited because when you do bring the data in and then you're looking at it and then you could build off of the stuff that's sitting there immediately. Yeah. We'll be looking 
at this right here. If it goes to zero, it may be because you're standing in front of it. All right, there you go. Easy, easy. Boom. All right, so what you can do with that trigger is you're gonna long press it, so hold it. Okay, I'm gonna go. There you go. All right, so now it's initiating, and now tap the trigger, and it starts the laser. So I kind of need to watch the computer and the car. A little bit, yep, exactly. Okay. And you'll probably be watching the computer mostly, and just kind of seeing if you're, if you get a little bit closer, and. Uh, I might not be cut out for scanning. Maybe I should switch to racing. <laughs> Here, let me see what it's doing. Here's a look, I give it to you and you break it. See, I told you I shouldn't do this. He, he didn't know what's wrong with the triggers because he handed it to me. <laughs> I told you guys, maybe I should just leave this to you guys. Brad, you broke it. I, I, did I not tell you? That was the first <laughs> thing I told you today. It is kind of crazy to hold something that expensive, like if like you actually think about that. I tap it and it doesn't do anything. I tried telling you guys. Yeah, maybe it's my... I tried telling you, don't they, let me have like it. Okay, so is it a short press? Did I, short press? did I seriously break it? Man, I don't know, it might have. It's just not working then? So, red I light. I held it for 30 seconds. Mm -hmm. Does this usually happen? No, never. <laughs> <laughs> never. You it, didn't even sign a release form. Well, I mean, I'm glad you guys have your own insurance. <laughs> you signed the waiver to be here, so that's, you know, your choice, I guess. We just borrowed this thing. <laughs> <laughs> it is kind of ironic. Literally the first thing I said, don't hand it to me, I might break it. I even pretend dropping it in the beginning. Man, I I adjusted this before we began, but we tell it what resolution we want to scan in, which determines how much data it captures. What resolution is it scanning? So I'm scanning um, today in two millimeter. Two millimeters, there's a data point on the car. What, what would that transfer to? It like just, It would be 80 thousandths of an inch. I love that he knows that, that's crazy. Roughly 80 thousandths. <laughs> 80 thousandths. Holy cow. What do I do? Just tap the uh, trigger. And you broke it again. Oh it's my broken. gosh, are you kidding <laughs> me? All right, you know, I'm just gonna leave it to you guys. So it's I keep something. doing something. Anything. <gasps> yeah, okay. Now we're talking. Dad, I've broke this thing twice. Well, the good thing about you doing it is it just shows any idiot can do it. <laughs> <laughs> wow. See, they didn't even laugh because they're like, what's wrong with you? Okay, so that's a limit then, right? Yeah. This is the most important part, especially for the wide body. We've got to make sure we have every little piece because see what I'm doing right now is I'm putting 1.8 million dots on this car. Per second. Per second. <laughs> per second. Yep. All right. Do I just press the blue the button? Or is it, are we scanning already? You're rocking. You're rocking already. Oh, look at that. Got to get all these. All right. You guys oh. got it. We're leaving. <laughs> see you guys. Sweet. We're all good here. Thank you. Isn't that kind of crazy? Dude, it's like so advanced technology like it blows my mind that is unbelievable scanning isn't new to me but what is new to me is how fast they did it like he's saying all those millions of points and stuff at least with having the car on the computer like this now we, we have options that we could do i mean if we didn't you know decide to wide body and make a cool hood or something now we can because we have the model on the computer and now once he sends me this after we're done we could go through and build anything we want on it obviously i can't afford a scanner like this so i have to have you know him him come in to do this what's kind of cool with what they're talking about is they make a bunch of different scanners for the, the consumer so they have, you know they have like a tiered structure obviously this is the bad boy 150,000 one that i almost broke <laughs> Almost. But they have tears, so this is this is pretty interesting, and hopefully all you guys watching th thought that that was kind of cool. I, I get a kick every single time I watch things like this just happen because technology nowadays is just impressive. So thank you guys so much. Yeah, thanks for having us out, Yeah, man. It was awesome. Yeah, you guys, so you guys saved, us, man. actually, I want to say saved, well, no, you saved a lot of time, but it's going to yeah. be a lot more work at the end of the day because we're gonna make yeah. a wide body or something. <laughs> <laughs> something super cool. Yeah, we'll do something. So they got everything on the computer. He's, he has some uh, final things to do to actually send it over before we could start designing. But this Lincoln is now on the computer and anything we wanna do to it from this point forward, we're gonna do. And my dad is a very against doing a wide body and it just makes me wanna do it. I mean, he wants a V8, everyone's saying 2JZ. It makes me wanna do a small motor. I don't know what's gonna happen. All I know is this was cool. You guys have a blessed day. Thanks for watching. Until next time, give us some ideas. Put it in the comments. I'll wait till it's up on the screen. <laughs> that was great. So you kind of have to have this. I forgot to tell you. To me. All right, rite of passage. Hi there, partner. <laughs> you, you feel like more powerful using it? I feel like Iron Man. Like if Iron Man like had a bunch of lasers.
He does have lasers. Doesn't he have lasers? I don't think so. He has yeah, lasers. He needs, he's got to have lasers. Yeah. He's got to have lasers. <laughs>